hey guys welcome back to my channel it's cynthia with keep calm couponing so i was undecided about whether or not i was hitting up dollar general today but i wanted to grab um a couple items that my husband is low um on and like you know replenish my stockpile on that so definitely headed out today to see what i could pick up so the first item i picked up was this colgate toothpaste it's priced at a dollar there's a two dollar digital making the final cost completely free and one dollar in overage next item i picked up was the chlorolin um bleach cleaners priced at a dollar each you can find these in your dollar section there's a dollar and fifty cent off of two digital coupon making the final cost just 25 cents each Next item I picked up were these two Huggies Wipies priced at $2.25 each. I'll be using a three off of two digital making the final cost just $1.50 for both. Next item I picked up was this Airwick Oil Warmer priced at $2.00. Y'all it was $1.65 and it went up. I'm not feeling inflation at all but we're going to do what we got to do. But $2.00 there's a $1.99 digital coupon making the final cost just one penny. Next item I picked up was this Scott toilet paper priced at $3. There's a dollar digital making the final cost just $2. Next two items I picked up were these Dove hand soaps priced at $3.60 each. I'll be buying two which brings me to $7.20. I'll be using this three off of two printable coupon you'll receive in your email after you sign up. There's also a dollar and fifty off of two dollar general store coupon. Now, typically you can't combine two coupons together, but at Dollar General, you can combine a manufacturer coupon and a dollar store coupon. The difference between the two is that a dollar general store coupon has that big banner over top that says dollar general coupon i think i'll insert a picture up above so you can combine that with a manufacturer coupon you cannot combine two manufacturer coupons if that's a little bit confusing drop a comment down below um, and just ask me any clarifying questions and i'll be happy to answer those for you but buying both after the three dollars and the dollar fifty digital brings me to two dollars and seventy cents out of pocket I'll also get back a dollar and 25 cents for each on fetch making the final cost just 10 cents each next item i picked up was this double pack of dove deodorants priced at 450 and there's no digital coupons for this item okay guys so i actually put back the um, $3 pack of Scott toilet tissue just because I couldn't find the two deodorants and I was a few dollars shy of my $25 threshold to get that five off of 25 digital to apply so what I did was I put that $3 um, Scott tissue back and I grabbed the $5 pack instead there's that dollar digital making the final cost just $4 okay guys so this was everything that I picked up today everything went completely fine at the register my printable coupon went through just fine and so did all of my digitals let me show you my receipt before i forget though guys i met a really cool um cashier today at dollar general her name was shantae i believe if i got it wrong let me know in the comment section um sis was so hyped that i was saving some coins and that's the type of cashier you want like you want somebody that's hype that you saving money not somebody that's hating you know i know y'all y'all have come across those cashiers um but she was super nice super excited and she actually subscribed to the channel literally before she rang up her next customer so good looking sis so shout out to Shantae again drop a comment down below if I like got your name wrong or anything um but let me go ahead and show you this receipt Again, as you can see, all of my digitals came off just fine. Now, at the like register, Jordan wanted a pack of Welch's Fruit Snacks, which was 34 cents. So that brought my total up a little bit more, um, but still no issue. Total for everything came to $26.54. I had a total of $18.99 in coupons. So I paid $7.55 before tax out of pocket. I also got back $2.60 from Fetch, making the final cost for everything just $4.95. So I was super excited about that. Again, I really needed the deodorant and the other items were a plus. Also need the Huggies Wipies as well. Um, and I get like... Sometimes people ask me like, well, isn't it sometimes just easier to just go buy the one item that you need and walk out the store? And it's like, yes, 
and no. It could definitely be quicker if you didn't prep for the haul. But for example, all I really was looking to get was the Dove deodorant. That double pack is $4.50, but I paid $4.95 for all of it. So, I mean, you want to pay $4.50 for one item or $4.95 for 11 items? Like, I don't know. Like, I, I, I just feel like it's a no-brainer. Like, especially now with prices going up and stuff, like sis save your coins like what is you doing um but anyways guys that's it for me drop a comment down below let me know if you headed over to dollar general and did a five off a of 25 deal this weekend um also drop a comment down below let me know if you're new so that i can welcome you if you're not new thank you so much for coming back i really appreciate it and if you've made it this far in the video i want to thank you guys so much for watching and i'll talk to you soon Bye. bye, bye. <laughs>